Okay, um, it's a little bit windy, but I'm gonna try to show the uh, aircraft is going in random directions when only receiving yaw input. Um, so instead of staying in one place and rotating um, along the vertical axis, it uh, kind of goes in different directions. Um, is a little bit windy, uh, which you'll you'll see as the aircraft tries to correct itself uh, due to the wind. Um, but I've got a camera here and a camera there, and we'll see uh, see if we can show it. Get it going. I'm gonna ring this a little higher. All right, that's pretty good, right? Right about there. We don't have a ton of wind, so um, I'm gonna just try to give it a rotate to the right. And you can see now it's kind of going in a, in a different direction, right? Right at me. Here it's real close. Oh, it does kind of go back, but. That was a lateral movement of about 10 feet that I wouldn't expect. And it makes flying around any kind of obstacle um, rather difficult. So I'm gonna get a little alt altitude here and attempt to show that one more time. Um, if you can see, let's see, so like this, and you can see the drone. Now we'll rotate it to the right a little bit, and you can see there it uh, there it goes. With no other no other inputs, it kind of kind of moves backwards there. Um, it does come back to its spot, but I, I would say that's unexpected. Um, it happens in both directions, so I can turn to the right, and you can see it's now it's moving away from me, um, and it does kind of come back. So the wind's died down just a little bit. So this is a good, good example. Um, we'll do that one more, one more time with the, um, only with the right input. And it's just, I'm giving it just slight inputs and you can see there it goes. It's kind of taken off in that direction and, and going downward. Um, so yeah, so I think that that kind of shows it.